Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. My name's Phil and this is... Hey guys, I'm Sam, welcome back. Glad to have you with us for another reaction video and today we've got Bobby Hatfield, one half of the Righteous Brothers duo. Yeah, and we started with them early on in the channel, so it's been a long time since we've done anything by them. Oh, it's been a while. I mean, we've sprinkled in over the past few months some Righteous Brothers material, uh, but it's been a while for sure since we've done one. And when we started the channel, you know, over a year ago, yeah. um, the Righteous Brothers were one of the first duos, artists, groups that opened our eyes to the potential of so many other you know, artistic expressions yeah. and great artists that are out there. Yeah, they are incredible and really, really cool to see like somebody from that time period because it's such a different style of music that than what's popular now. So. Was really unfamiliar to us. Mm -hmm. And I think that was so refreshing for our experience. When yeah, we, for sure. When we got to check that out, right? So we're doing Bobby Hatfield. I think it's just going to be him, although it looks like the duo is on stage here on the uh, video. It looks yeah, like both of them matching outfits. Here. Yeah, like you gotta, if you're going to be a duo, then you got to have matching outfits apparently as well. <laughs> but I think it's just Bobby on this one. He's doing <laughs> Summertime from 1965 here. Um, maybe we'll get something from uh, the other half, but uh, yeah. you ready to check it out? I am. Let's do it. Let's roll. I'm uh, my solo Willie, so why don't you give me a groovy introduction like only you can, baby? Okay, Bob, leave it to me. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to introduce a young man whose brother is probably one of the greatest entertainers in the business today. <laughs> I would also like to introduce a young man whose brother is probably one of the best looking people in the business <laughs> say nothing of his talent here he is ladies and gentlemen trying it on his own <laughs> <laughs> my brother Bob singing sometime go ahead Bob good one Okay. Let's go, Bobby. I think Bobby's got something to prove on this one. <laughs> he is killing this. I was like, okay, Bobby, let's go. It started so subtly as well, yeah, it's right? Like and then, <laughs> so nice. You're like, oh, this is going to be calm and cool. And then yeah. it just explodes with the sun coming from summertime. Yeah, it's crazy. Also, I've heard the quote, like, summertime in the living's easy, like, a million times before. And I never knew that it was from, like, a song or something. Mm. It's, it's yeah. from this. I don't think this is an original that they wrote. I think they're performing yeah. something that's else But I had no idea wrote. it came from a song. Yeah, uh, I had no idea either. But uh, Bobby's doing his thing, had an introduction, and he said, all right, well, I'm going to have to set this one off. And it's cool yeah. to see just him on the stage while there's all this uh, instrumentation going on. Um, I would like love to have seen it. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know if this is being played live or not but mm -hmm. um i think from our experiences it sounds similar to the instrumentation that we've heard 
in that like there's some strings they incorporate the brass you know the, the touch of the percussion in there yeah, i'm loving the brass in there i feel like it like complements his range and his vocals very nice yeah it gives you that classic vibe as yeah. well right that we've discussed prior right and um i think they've maybe channeled some of the this is 1965 right so, and uh, you know we got We've got accustomed to their sound a little bit, but it seems like from the other stuff that we've heard around that time period, it doesn't really fit in the same way, right? It's kind of like they are on the back end of the generations that came before them, mm -hmm. or the eras that came before them, yeah. I should say, and they're still channeling that yes. and doing it obviously tremendously. But it sounds vastly different than probably a lot of the other stuff that was coming out in the from 60s, the 60s right? yeah. So I'm, I'm loving yeah, like it. To though. me, like this definitely has more of like a classical kind of vibe opposed to like more of that like groovy kind of sound that was coming from. Oh the yeah, 60s. it's it's definitely more of a gentleman's yes. vibe than you know yeah. what we've heard from more of the rock side of things, yeah. right? So anyway, so let's sure. keep it going and see what Bobby does in the back half. again thank you thank you very much he's like i'm back thank you thank you very much i'd like to thank you for that uh, introduction willie my pleasure we have done several concerts and every concert we do billy sings a song that gets very much response we get thousands and thousands of letters but he's still going to do it tonight <laughs> <laughs> Slow down. That was Bobby Hatfield's Summertime. Now I'm like, hey, what's the other guy going to do? <laughs> Maybe we'll have to check that out if you guys want us to. If there's a video available, I would be open to doing it because yeah. uh, we got to see one half, got to see the other half now. Yeah, and, uh, that was awesome. Yeah, it was great. I mean, it was um, clearly the vocal performance was fantastic. We know he's an amazing vocalist. Um, would have been great if you know we would be, were able to hear this now. You yeah. know, 60 years later yeah. with the quality that they would be able to put together with it. Yeah. I, I imagine it would sound so unbelievably fantastic because it sounds great here. But, you know, it's like I said, 60 years ago. So yeah, obviously crazy. text improved in the way they captured the sound on especially on videos. Right. So um, it was great, though. He just was going off, man. Just. Yeah, even at the end there, like, I mean, the whole song still had more of that kind of like classic gentleman -y feel, but towards the end there with the brass and just the way he was going off his vocals, it almost gave me like a jazz kind of mm -hmm. vibe, which is cool. Yeah. Well, the energy just picked up throughout in that one, mm -hmm. right? It was, you know, we started off subtly, as we said in the break, and then towards the end, he just kept going. The instrumentation picked up, the energy, the vibrancy of the song picked up. So it was a great performance. Really cool. Really very much yeah. enjoyed it. I'm glad we came back to Bobby. It's been a long time since we've, we've done them, but, you know, it's refreshing when you come back to an artist that's so talented yeah. and they do their thing and you're yeah. just like, oh, yeah, I forgot how good you were. <laughs> like, yep, re-verified of how awesome you are. <laughs> that's right. So hopefully you guys enjoyed our reaction to Bobby Hatfield doing yes. Summertime. I did for sure. And uh, if you did, make sure you hit the like button for us. Leave us a comment. Let us know what your thoughts are on this performance, how it may resonate with you and your upbringing and any experiences that you had and any memories that it brings back for you. Let us know in those comments. We love reading those. And uh, make sure you hit the subscribe button if this is your first time on the channel. We've got other Righteous Brothers, but we got lots of different music. We also have sports, comedy, and history now. Mm -hmm. So we got lots of different content for you to enjoy with us. We'd love to have you on board. So if you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell, we'll see you in our next video. Thanks for watching, guys, and we'll see you then.